Hey Star Family, Star Stable Archie here with another of our tutorial videos made by superfan Esmeralda Kingley. On the island of Jorvik there are lots of different people with lots of different aims and goals in life. Mr. Kemble wants to demolish Moreland Stables and build luxury apartments, Jack Goldspur wants to do pretty much anything else apart from be the mayor of Jarlaheim, little Lisa Jarlison wants to be big, Nick Stoneground wants to find a magical fairy tale valley, and Idris, well, nobody really knows what he wants at all. All of these characters with their different families, friends and goals belong to what we call reputation factions. This means that there are different groups all over Jorvik that you need to get to know so that they trust you enough to reveal the secrets of the island. These groups can be families like the Sunfields or the Goldspurs, villages like Valedale and Firgrove, and groups like the Keepers of Aideen. You'll always get reputation points when you complete quests and the higher your reputation with a faction, the more quests you'll get access to. More than that, it also means you'll be able to buy more and more things from that particular faction's shops. But hang on, it's not always enough to just do the normal quests. You'll often need to complete daily quests, which are like regular quests, except for the character offering them to you has got a blue exclamation mark over their head instead of a yellow one. These kinds of quests pop up on certain days, and whilst they don't give you any XP, they do give you Jorvik shillings and those all-important reputation points. If a character has a quest for you that needs a higher reputation level than you currently have, it'll be represented by a heart inside a circle above the character's head. As soon as you've reached the right reputation level, you'll be able to start the quest, but you might need to work on those daily quests for more than just a couple of days to increase that reputation. There are five different levels of reputation. Neutral, friendly, liked, popular, and admired. Once you reach admired, you've maxed out and can't increase your reputation, but the quests can be fun anyway, right? You can see where your reputation's at right now, as well as see how far away from the next reputation level you are by taking a look at your character sheet. Don't forget to follow us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram and add us on Snapchat. Is there anything you're unsure about and want us to make a special tutorial for? Leave a comment below. And lastly, don't forget to like and subscribe for more cool, exclusive stuff from Star Stable. Thanks for watching!